Good morning all, we're here with uh, Martin Huddy from X-Ray obviously and uh, yesterday he helped me out with some really cool tips on how to set the tweak up and uh, I set my car up like it last night and uh, to be fair, ran about just as good as I've ever been able to get it to run. So Martin is going to kindly explain to us how he sets his tweak up on his, on his T4 chassis. So over to you Martin. Okay. So the first, uh, what I do when I'm checking my tweak is that I put my car on the on the downstop blocks. I always put it in the space where the the blocks doesn't touch the any screws, so it's here and here. So I put it always on the blocks first, and I press the cars, I press the chassis on the on those sides, and to check if it's all okay. After each run. Uh, I untie the, the screws on the top deck to make uh, sure that I uh, remove all the unwanted wigs and you know the, the stress of the car, which is after the run. Even if I don't, uh, if I don't crash, I, I do it. So I untie the screws and uh, I tie them again. I don't uh, force too much to tight. I, I just you know uh, tightening it gently, and I'm not forcing the car at all. I don't use any stick, nothing. I'm just you know using. So I double check it, and then I'm lifting the, the both sides. I am lifting the both sides of the car to see if they are moving in the in the same uh, in the same way. Like if some size, uh, some some uh, one side is going super quick, and some you know, very slow. That means that there is some uh, some tweak problem, and it doesn't have to be uh, connected with the top deck, but maybe it's from the bulkhead, from the bottom, or the shock tower. So I need to untie that and tie it again. Those. But now it feels okay. So what I do, I I check the next step is to check the downstop. So I make sure that I have the, the same same downstop. So I use uh, this track four in the rear and five in the front. I'm checking it in front of the arm. Looking good. Next step is to, to quickly check the right height of the car. So I put my racing tires on. And I'm checking the right height uh, over here behind the, the front suspension. I use the five down stop in the front. I check it in the same position uh, on the both sides, turning the car and again and in front of the suspension checking. I, in the rear I use 5.2. Making, making sure that I set it, uh, I have it correctly on the both sides. Then I'm checking the, the spring tension. It's important to have the, the same spring tension. It's uh, the, the one when it's one spring uh, loose and the second is tight. That means that there is some problem. Uh, either with the tweak or with the, with the spring setting. Now I, I uh, check the spring setting. I always do it with uh, with the hoodie wheels. I never use the tires because tires are uh, no, not uh, it's not perfect diameter. So uh, always use the the hoodie wheels for this. Okay, now I will uh, set the front spring tension by lifting the rear part of the car. The chassis has a two, uh, two points over in the rear and also in the front. This is the place where I put a 1.52 and I am uh, lifting the car and I'm checking if the both wheels are uh, uh, going up in the same uh, time. Over here I see the right side is lifting earlier than the left, so I have to tie the, uh, the left front spring and untie the, the right spring. Again. Checking if now it's, it's okay. Well, now the left one, so I, I put it too much, so I need to go uh, backwards a little. Okay, now it's lifting at the same time. Now I do the same same for the for the rear springs. All race guys, work together, give each other space. Well done, coming on a spread. Outstanding. 
Thank you. Here I need to, I see that I need to tie the this ring a little bit and untie this one. <laughs> Okay, now it's perfect, lifting at the same time. So what I do at the end, I double check to make sure that nothing is wrong. I check the spring tension, if the both springs are have the same. Okay, the feeling is same, my car is set, I'm ready to go. Once again, thank you Martin, appreciate well, your time. I hope you will find this as a, a help for uh, your future races and uh, you will have no problem with the tweak anymore. <laughs> thank you Martin, much, much appreciate.